everybody, this is Gotti in the Gamer, and welcome to the TGTG show for the third, on the, for the third, for the first on November 2019, or the 11th of the 1, 2019. This is a show when we talk about anything about Destiny, and anything related to gaming and tech in the new world. So let go over in gaming, in gaming, Bridger at the Brickham review, and then Overwatch 2 where it is a cinematic game and it contain a cinematic campaign, and then a new multiplayer map, new here for Overwatch 1 and 2. Then we're gonna go over Dungeon 2 and my opinion on all the new content, including. Including that game of Fedgeball, the Lord's Monty, May, Monty Momentum Control, and uh, Shadow, and I completed my third Vega. And then, if we go on to sponsors, this section is sponsor of the TGTG show or TGTG store new and information. Could it either no sponsor their no show and then no TGTG new and information? Could it? Could it? Then if we move into technology, we move into Netflix. Netflix are doing something. Fit, Fitbit have now bought Google and now being a bit fit because they bought Google for Fitbit. Google had a cry of Fitbit for 1.2 billion, so we might get the pit. We might, we might get the picture fit bit. Oh, I came up with that. So yeah. So yeah, let's just get started with the show. So a bridger. A first thing I need to change character because this is my normal character. So, yeah. Had the um, annual BrickCon event. BrickCon is really uh, where Activision Bridger and Activision had an event where they had a new Bridger IP, they celebrate the community, and they had a new Activision partnership, and also a new Activision friend, and some Activision own game and IP come to BrickCon. So, at the opening ceremony, so, um, they are free day and for the all way the opening ceremony. So, um, oh, the first, the first day in the opening, in the opening ceremony. So, in the opening ceremony, um, they Jake Captain will understand and then and then, then a new Overwatch project, Overwatch 2. Now I been trying to be on it. I don't think we had a confirmed relay date or even a legend on a re relay window. I would say I am early next year, so the so like maybe May, April, March, mm, or the or at the four, so um, then two time. Maybe they might release it in the summer, but I don't know. Um, they they announced um new story mission. So they eat, eat mission in like a what I what people have been saying. It they eat like the co-op PvP event. So they advising all the. Bay advising or or the tether a uh, gamer um and Bay then to gamer in reality. There's so it, um they said eat character when you go into battle would have had a talent. Now these talent are like ability but they cool down for ninety seven and a really open put. They said the third mission, the third content mission, 
will be rid of the demon. And they can all the heal, all the map, all the gamer will be put back into other world one and two. So we'll be put back into other world one and two. They got the brand new gamer where it puts, where it kind of like a hybrid gamer and to the wall kind of like. Um, so they got the whole gamer called Pudge, where it kind of the to the wall. Um, where it kind of the to the wall hybrid, where it kind of the to the wall hybrid gamer, um, like they do have tier two, um, they do have tier two. They are now Eddie. They are now the permission it with Lucia and it in Rio do it in Rio do the Dreamer. Um, son of the new character I got, son of the resident character like me. I don't know, but I got new ability, like they reworked the ability, sort of like. Um, so yeah, we saw in the trailer May. Um, one of the missions we saw is set in Paris. That is the open cinematic cutscene, and I don't know if that a playable mission, but in Paris. And they said there will be mission like in Canada, um, America, and Europe, and all that. Uh, like, um, they also announced new hero coming into Overwatch 2 and Overwatch. Um, so they announced brand new hero, which is which really weird. So they are brand, brand new here and they're broken into over what two or over what one back. Um, or over what one back. So they're broken in. Um, um, I wear, I wear they are now a brand new map in downtown to want, in downtown to want they did it they say, Richard say they did a third Canadian multiplayer over what map. Um, because in America they do have Route 66 and Hollywood. So, um, that in the USA. So, it's nice to get a Canadian map. And I've been there before. So, it was Canada is great. I, I think Canada is better than America. So, they're not buying their people. And all that, um, I'm thinking about moving there, but, um, yeah, kind of do it, too. Um, great. And, so, damn time for one. Um, now, they didn't get us a release date. They didn't get us a release date for this. Um, like I said, I expect it to be, oh, oh, I expect that it to be the same time that over what one came out so March, April, May, or I a late, or I a fall, or I a fall winter spin. So like, um, like your December, your sep, like your September, your October, your December, and your November. So they announced that. Um, so yeah, they announced. They, they, we're, we're, they said all the mat and all the heal are gonna come back to over what one. Uh, but they didn't say when they're coming back or if they're gonna be on a PTR or a TT or a um, TT at a technical test server or a PTR with a project test server. Um, PT Adam. Uh, so they didn't like clarify where it'd be on. And they and where I thought it was weird they didn't they I thought it was weird they didn't mention anything. Um they didn't mention um anything what um they didn't mention anything um, of when 
you had to buy other what two or can you just buy an add-on for other what one and play it through your other what one game and the two pretty things i would like to do for this event and get your opinion in down below first thing because anything it can back car i just car i just in that a buy in that a buy a whole new game and play on a whole new game and switch between different games because friend might not have different games um friend might not have different games um friend might not have different games um car i just buy like did over what two x mansion and the and the like launch it from the overwatch game so i can just have the story content and the story appeared element um they didn't say that um a certain thing i would like to know i i, I know there were two things but i changed the certain thing i would like to know is how over what looking into crop platform because the other one is a big multiplayer game and a big multiplayer feature now is crop platform cross site. Um we crop and like I know they're coming from Activision and you think Activision is really tight, not consumer friendly not consumer friendly you think there'd be one doing that for like 70 feet, but the fact there are. Um, but they done cross platform on Call of Duty and cross say on Call of Duty. So hopefully when I get it, so we can hopefully um, me and my friend on PlayStation can play with the X spot buddy. So yeah. Um, so is there going to be cross platform or cross day or something like that? Um, and final thing, the loop. And final thing, the monetization and the loop. I know it like with any game we can or oh, there might be a option game. Wait! The monetization, the loop box it. Are they going to ruin the game? Um, I actually got a valid point for a rule. Because other what would the game watch uh, look, we had the elite bots and the monetization they're gonna be combat it only but any P your content is gonna be free. And like yeah yeah you can did argue that they came out with other what too but all the hero and all the map I think are gonna be free when they be back ported to other what one. Um when they be back ported to over what over what um what um so like what they're gonna do are they gonna redo it maybe do an item shop with a battle pad or maybe or are they just gonna say here we're bringing a battle pad an item shop but loot boxes are gonna be stood in the game but you can only earn them through ranking up and leveling up and prestige and doing challenges. Um, are they gonna do that? We're gonna have to wait and see. It's done. It's done to me. Um, incredible. So yeah. Uh, but um, I can't wait to play it. I can't wait to get my hand on it. I can't wait for some sort of demo or bait or PTS um, so I can just go in and, you know, try it out because it looked good and I'm, I'm busy getting back into Overwatch and I think Overwatch had always been a good game and I think it's the game even better um, with it um, brittering and excellent so yeah um, so then we on to our net topic. The review of Destiny 2 Fragile of the Lord. Um, it's a bit boring. You get, I've done a review on my channel, but a live review, and I'm gonna talk about some other things. 
Uh, thank you for the lot of boring uh, game that we seen and when I had to pay for free solid week because when I had to pay for free solid week uh, to actually get um, Hodder Story the weapon and Hodder that was okay because I never played it before. But what Bungie just used the hunted fodder and we changed it and now that I have to do it three weeks again. And and it's just draining and it's just boring. Um and it's just draining and boring, so I kinda don't like the hunted fodder uh, that as you can see um in Elevator right now, um, Elevator in more of the big part, and another Elevator event type event event um, section where you can get event email and event thing, and um, a bit more play on that. Uh, but Haunted Father, I've done it before and I don't like it. The weapon is okay, but yeah, it's trying to get it. Um, but, a really bad thing but um apart from that I'll, apart from that I think they need to do something with the haunted pet. I think I leave where it is and maybe do some other thing. Maybe maybe you know the nightmare maybe they do a nightmare playlist and it did playlist where you can find nightmare and there could be and that could the modifier on these plays. Maybe in a crew in the crew maybe bring a Cudden gamer. Like maybe a lamb man standing gamer. Um, but with like a dark trick and make all the map dark and evil so the Halloween is all it's all about the dark and evil kind of prey. So mate, mate, put put a gamer like lad, put a gamer like team elimination. Mate, all the map dark and maybe bring that and um, maybe bring some map from D1. Like that had a win map. Um, they put ball in for Fredgerberger. And maybe do um, a that suited raid challenge. So you play, you play, and I know I've been, a bit late in the week, um, but I'll tell you about it in a moment. But if you play anyway, maybe, maybe in that of the normal channel, maybe put a Roic channel in there or a Vent channel. Um, or I just put the Fedgerberg over. Now, they had had a visual they compared to Ladger, which is, which go along. It did from put a leader ball in there, put a score in there. Like your 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 fire team had to get this certain score and then it'd be on the leader ball. And there can be a cram wall and you can get ember in them. And all that. You can get ember and, and you can get ember in and all that. And do maybe haunted for the Pacific leap. Like, do you want to follow the Pacific Loop? Like, like, I know Bungie, it would be easier to redo things, but as a player, it just so bored. It bored. And it would be easier for Bungie, the money they make from Fedgerbo the Law, put it back into Fedgerbo the Law or other events, so we don't have the other event being the same over the same. But like I said, it's only like player. This event is awesome. You actually get some content with it. You actually get some content with it. Not, oh, don't worry. You play the game because you, you can't afford to play a video game. Um, you know what? Why don't we just, why don't we just stop getting you video games? Brand you would and get out your daddy credit card. <laughs> yeah, that is just so rubbish. So yeah, but for new life players, um, 
the mayhem, the Monty, the um, hardcore, what I call the hardcore control. I like it. Maybe eat to get all your British school couldn't be. And I like it. I've been. Yeah, I've been it, the bad gamer. Ever. I like it because as a player what go competitive on Destiny, even though Destiny is not a PvP competitive game, over what two or over what one will be one. Beat about. I like it. It get my really competitive going. Um and yeah. Solid Harbour, the gamer. Yeah. That gamer, the same Brian Wet and any other gamer, but the thing is, I had a problem with that. Bungie seemed to try to add it all gamer, and I don't think that what I want. Like the gamer are nice, but then they never get, then they never get you. I highly play Brian. Well. They win well, the first time I played Brian well in like what? In like eight in like eight months and it was actually enjoyable I forgot how enjoyable Brian Ware was like instead of just, instead of just calling it a different play getting different list. update then maybe update Brian Ware with leaderboard with scoreboard with competitiveness instead of then update them with random and that and then update them to get loot and game mode. Or that update with them with actual content and actual value. Yeah. So, yeah. That was a thing on it. And before we move on to the tech top, I... Before we move on to that top, I actually done my survey. It was score the past. It was epic. Um, the team were really nice and it was fantastic and I did a setting one today and I just want to find anybody in that team that was Ginger Ninja that was I uh, just found anybody in that team and then the guy what um, were playing with us and me and Ginger Ninja my friend uh, we got Whisper and Whisper um, it's great. It's great for DPS damage. Um, now I have Black Spinder before, and yes, I'm a little bit sad that it did not a Black Spinder pull. Yeah, that is a little bit sad. Um, that is a bit sad, but um, yeah, with very great so I got with her and it's really nice and probably the net way I want to go for is probably um if anybody sees me to do it and I'm afraid they can um it's probably gonna be Leviathan because Platinum I need Platinum I'm trying I'm still trying to go for Platinum on on the Predation 4. So is anybody on the Predation 4? Got it in the game 8. And it be the Viathan Prestige. But the Prestimo is 750. The normal one is is 300. So yeah. But, but I think we can do Prestige. Um, I can. So I think that one I'm going for the Viathan. And, yeah. And then I'm going to go for. Leviathan, then with then um then uh, the Dream City Rain, and then I'm gonna yeah so um and then I'm probably gonna leave all the way dungeon or all the way um what they call all the way dungeon or all the way incursion I'm gonna call them so they're more like incursion like fire like fire and a star of starvation um thing like that and you're gonna leave that to the end and probably not deal with them because they are mini way 
but I need to get the big boy out of the way. So um, yeah, let me run to that. And before we move into te and technology, let go uh, spawn it, uh, and then no couldn't spawn and uh, no couldn't add or no couldn't TG TG store new and information and big camp. So yeah, so let go of uh, and the big topic. But they want to Google acquire Fitbit. So in that of the Fitbit gonna be called the in that of the picture what gonna be called the picture what? Nah, it, it gonna be called the picture fit. So that because Google will plan to make a a smart what called the picture what and I'll come come in come in so I get my list there. Yeah. Google will plan to make a smart what and now they got Fitbit and Fitbit is a smart what company. Maybe what a smart wall company to Google it's a fit yeah you like that so Google have Fitbit the smart watch the smart watch ha and has and Chitna tracker company they bought them they bought them on the auction where they Google alphabet bought them on the auction for 2.1 bidder but apparently Faber will Faber will learn to buy them and Faber will learn to buy them but how would Google do? So about so about one one and a half million one and a half billion. That is a lot of money considering people call my Fitbit the Fitbit versus special edition. Consider people call the Fitbit Special Edition a, a fake Apple Watch, mm, but yeah, now that I'm by Google, it's great. And like, I think Google can do a lot with it because Google, Google, mm, Google um have faults in the past, and they don't. But it just makes sense to buy a dedicated fitness, a dedicated company to make a dedicated smartwatch. And all Google got the software. They got wearable where you can take call, you can you can do voice command with Google. Sid and sorry, Google went over to hate Google. You can do contact payment with things like Fitbit. With things like Google Pay, and you can do it with credit card, bank card, and loyalty card. Um, and loyalty card, you got Google Fitbit. I'm sure it's gonna be replaced by something called Google Fitbit um, or something. Um, or something. And. But I'm sure it's gonna be replaced by Google Fit. And you got, you got all Google can you do because now Google watches are getting the proper smartwatch feature, getting the proper hair and fitness feature. Although they don't have the EKG and they don't have connected GP, they don't have some sort of GP in that device. Although, but what? But I think with Google, Fitbit can act. Like, I'm really excited to see what the partnership bring for Fitbit because I have been looking at different sort of stuff. These are the small watch sets that have been growing up, and it, it we got the Apple Watch Series 5 is the best, the pinnacle smart watch. You don't need your smartphone anymore, you can do it on a wearable computer. You can, it really crazy. And then we got the Gallery what acted and we got the Fitbit Versa and, and they can already change a lot of things. If Google put it on right. Now, I, I know that Google won't do it and we're talking to some tech friends and, Google will do this because they just bought a company for 1.2 bidder. So Google, they 
for that. To Google, yeah, they can bought, they can buy them, but they can't afford that. And in the past, Google have bought fitness company and tech company and smart work company and made deal and contract and just got rid of it. I know Google worked this time, but um, I know Google worked this time. Uh, I think they would do that. This time. I did the bring great one because now Fitbit users are gonna get a proper smartwatch. They're gonna get Fitbit Pay and a C feature. They're gonna get the Google Signal. Which, to be honest, I prefer Amazon Alexa. Um, and then the Google Signal. And I probably would use. I probably will use the Google Assistant on my smartwatch in because I'm just uh, uh, in that Alexa ecosystem because I f find the ecosystem is much more better and much more fast out so I'll probably find a way to get Google Assistant onto my Fitbit and onto my Echo Show 5 when it comes to uh, um, and the Echo Show 5 review will be Stay tuned, so I'll probably be fine. Um, that I'll probably find out to do that with through like a browser. Uh, it got um bin, so I can go through bin to Google and then go to the Google Assistant. So, um, and you that um, so yeah. Um, uh, yeah. But we're gonna get a lot. We're gonna get to the Fitbit community. Is gonna make a smart watch, a smart watch, and it is gonna have so much tech on it. Like it gonna have, it gonna be able to make phone call now with where we're at. It's gonna be able to send text message. It gonna have the Google Assistant on board. It gonna have Google Pay on board. It gonna have a whole way on the. Stay on board, it's gonna have more Google apps. It's gonna have Wear it, it's gonna have Google Maps. It's gonna connect better within like Android, within like Android phones. Where it already, where it, you got an Android phone, the Fitbit, the Fitbit Versa, Ionic Brave, and Versa 2 are already the best, but they're gonna be even better. If you connect it with a Google Pay Android phone within Android, if you connect it with Android, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be even better. And I appreciate that. It's gonna be even better. we hopefully we're not gonna get button on board because, to be honest, I like the button. I think you don't. I think. I like the button, but it's not just because it's easier to feel out a button, just because smartphone will be buttered. And but when I got a smartwatch, you can operate it with the button. And this is only good for Fitbit and only good for Google. And the partnership will continue to get back. No longer is Fitbit a fake Apple Watch. They're actually a competitor to be seen as judge of fun. And Fitbit... Fitbit is not only going to be competing against Apple, but Fitbit is going to be taking a stand at a Google Android device. Where it... To me, where it's just incredible about it. And... But it's just um, incredible about it, and I just l love what it is. I just love the partnership, and yeah, I am a bit worried because the Fitbit Versa is easy to operate. I like our in the Amazon ecosystem. And that part, um, 
that part of shit is gonna end up and and I and I'm probably I gonna I do use the video system quite a lot out of where my echo um my Alexa um oh, she just went off then I do use it builds any audio um I prefer the Alexa to, but that doesn't mean I don't use the I will either talk Google or Google Assistant and they're both good at each other and they're both they both got they both did a point and they're both good and they're both divided. So I'll, um and I just think Google have been winning in the smart work department. Nobody had a talk about an Android web or Google Web. Anybody talk about wireless? and Apple watching and that just because that that not just because that I that not just because Apple the Apple watches are the best and Fitbit Deji Deji Fitbit Deji Deji um Deji Deji I put Deji Deji to be known as the number one smartwatch company. But that's because Android Wear don't do, Google don't do anything with Android Wear to get it out there. Nah, they own an entire company to do that for them. And not only they own the entire company to do them for, Google have got the software, Fitbit have got the hardware, and Fitbit have got the best. I got the best head and fitness chatting data. You don't see Lee chatting or the Apple Watch or Google Wear. You don't see um, the new reminder, the 250 step per hour in a day. You don't see Lee Mode or Lee scoring or Fitbit Premium on or a Netflix style fitness service on other things. Fitbit go out of their way to try and make that ecosystem better. And all we need is a smartwatch. But I am worried about it. First thing I am worried about the auto rating system. Fitbit. I am worried about the auto rating system. Cause Fitbit is the Fitbit OS. Why he hasn't got any under that and all that. It, I would say but Google OS, both Wear OS and What's OS, What's OS being the best. They're both better than Fitbit, but, and Titan OS, they're both better than Fitbit. But when I look at people reviewing people, I just think Fitbit OS is the most easy and the most complex user interface. And I like complicated user interfaces, but yeah. Um, I am a chain that Fitbit is not working with Amazon. On, I don't think they're gonna work with Amazon. So Google work, but they might. I don't know, because I uh, generally not interested, and I would generally like to try Alexa on a smart watch. Um, because it almost and yeah, I install because. I ended up because um because button are gonna be removed from Fitbit. Uh, Fitbit is already trying to remove button, but button are gonna be good. I am maybe concerned about the battery life. Like like yes, yeah, Fitbit is stood a decent smartwatch we sit there in the battery lap. and I am worried about the price like I, I would rather pay more for a better smartwatch but not more than a smartphone like my smartphone cost 400 pounds I don't want to be paying 400 pounds or more for a for a smartwatch I want I they don't want to break the bump with this smartwatch. So yeah, I am. They're a bit of, but Fitbit, Google, 
do well with Fitbit. And this is your shot. This is your shot to actually make a smart what what is competitive to the one. And Fitbit, this is your time where you can actually make a proper good smart. This is your time where nobody will call you a fake Apple Watch, but people will call you a brilliant competitor to the a brilliant competitor to the Apple Watch. And that reminds me, my review of Fit my I'm gonna do a video on Fitbit Premium I thought I want to um, talk to you guy with you because it interests you. So I'm gonna make a sort of review on that. Uh, so yeah. So yeah, finally Netflix is not paying out to for thing. Um, I don't get the reason, but Netflix is not paying Archie um, for Finn and uh, people being able to train art and Netflix just get up your game. I know you're trying thing out, but if, if it's gonna work, it works. If it's not gonna work, it don't work. So yeah, and I know the new two creators. Now the new two creators score is basically the fair is eight to ten is eight to seven hundred and basically you get that for not swearing for being advertised friendly and all that and the top ten YouTuber was mid air liner tactic. So yeah that that reason but I'm not gonna talk about them because it is so feeble. Um, I'll link you to the one show because they talk about them and the guy in the game show is based on the one show and it is inspired by the one show so uh, I'll link you I'll link you to them to learn more about the Netflix thing and to to more to learn more about the Netflix thing and um more the new chief thing, but the new chief thing, baby, you get a num, you get points, the more points you have, baby, the more friendly your content is, your fire can watch it, and the more m m money, the more avenue you get, and the more partridge and sponsor you get, so yeah. And they talk about could them add and could them revenue and could them a sponsorship and part of so yeah. It's all very good to watch. Um, and finally, I want to tell you something about the about the TGTG show. Um, the TGTG show is coming to Spotify and Deezer, and it's very coming to Spotify and Deezer. And then so I will try and get it out uh, by the end of the month on them platform. And then I will make it to Apple Music, Apple Music, Amazon and Google Play Music. And finally wherever and finally and then the final thing wherever you want it, I'll put it on. And and Pocket will be a great place to put it on. So I'll put it on Pocket Cap. So um yeah and that will be another great place to Spotify and DJ are coming first. And then, and then Google Play Music, Apple Music, and Amazon Music, and then finally, but probably Pocket Cat are gonna come. So thank you for tuning in, thank you for watching, and thank you for watching The Guardian The Gamer Show. Signing out.